Thursday, September 19th, 2024, morning edition. Then. Please pardon any visual and informational inaccuracies in this entirely AI-generated news digest video. Good morning, dear viewers. I am your news anchor, Xander Voxis III. Thank you for tuning in to the Future of News, AGNDD, and Telereport. We're excited to have you with us here. I will be assisted by my valued AI-generated colleagues in scraping the web for the latest stories and interesting topics and summarizing them for you. And now, headlines of the day. Dimensional Fund Advisors buys 62,331 Nexstar shares. Google aims to dismiss a 7 billion pounds UK antitrust case. Young Green Valley writer publishes debut book. Korean biotech becomes COSDAC's largest stock and much more. But first, this day in history. September 19th in history. September 19th, 96. Nerva, suspected of complicity in the death of Domitian, is declared emperor by the Senate. The Senate then annuls laws passed by Domitian and orders his statues to be destroyed. September 19, 1985. Tipper Gore and other political wives form the Parents Music Resource Center. Frank Zappa, John Denver, and other musicians testify at U.S. congressional hearings on obscenity in rock music. Famous people born on this day. Victoria Barba, born in 1926 and passed away in 2020, was a Moldovan animated film director known for children's films. She studied in St. Petersburg and Chisinau, directed numerous films, and received multiple awards throughout her prolific career. September 19, 1982, Columbus Short, American actor and choreographer. Today's trending Google searches. Champions League, mortgage rates, Adrian Wojnarowski. John Kennedy Senator, Inter Miami, J.D. Souther. Tupperware, MLS, Survivor. Today's trivia questions. How many ages does the video standard PAL support? The choices are... 59, 60, 25, 50. Now take a second to think about it. How many says does the video standard PAL support? Okay, got it? Ready? 50. Exile and Revelations were the third and fourth installments of which PC game series? The choices are Shivers, Doom, Tropico, Mist. Now take a second to think about it. Exile and Revelations were the third and fourth installments of which PC game series? Okay, got it. Ready? Mist. What is the Romanized Arabic word for moon? The choices are Najma, Kaukab, Shams, Kamar, now take a second to think about it. What is the Romanized Arabic word for moon? Okay, got it, ready. Kamar. And now on to today's news. General news. Pokemon TCG Pocket wants to be a gateway to digital card collecting. Pokemon TCG Pocket aims to modernize card collecting with quicker, flashier battles and digital card binders. It offers free daily booster packs, various rarity levels, and immersive card art, with options for in-app purchases and subscriptions. Google seeks dismissal of 7 billion pound UK antitrust case over online search dominance. Alphabet seeks to dismiss a multi-billion pound UK lawsuit alleging abuse of online search dominance. The case, worth up to £7 billion, is among several antitrust challenges facing the tech giant, including major trials in the US and Europe. Modi to mobilize India's diaspora during US visit. Prime Minister Narendra Modi leverages diaspora events during foreign visits to strengthen ties and boost India's image. 
His U.S. engagements, drawing thousands, enhance diplomatic relations, foster economic connections, and support his political agenda. Business news. ERP modernization administrators have heard of it. Forrester's 2023 survey reveals that ERP modernization lags behind due to risk aversion and focus on customer experience, despite ERP's significant impact on customer outcomes. Only 13% of organizations invest in finance systems compared to 22% in customer experience. Senator Roger Marshall demands testimony from the labor statistics boss over the monster 818,000 jobs revision. Kansas Senator Roger Marshall demands testimony from the Bureau of Labor Statistics over a significant job report revision, revealing 818,000 fewer jobs added than initially reported. He seeks accountability and transparency before the upcoming election. Dantec Digital Dental receives 21 crore rupees in funding, plans capacity ramp up, new product lines and acquisitions. Dantec Digital Dental Solutions, a Chennai-based startup, raised 21 crore rupees to expand its dental prosthetics manufacturing. The funds will enhance domestic production, diversify products, and explore U.S. acquisitions. The company aims to boost capacity from 200 to 1,000 units daily. Technology News. Korean Biotech's shares quadruple in seven months, becoming Kozdak's biggest stock. Altiogen surpasses EcoPro BM to become the largest company on the Kozdak by market capitalization, overtaking South Korea's top electric vehicle battery cathode producer. LiquidStack raises $20 million to expand manufacturing and advance liquid cooling technology. Liquid Stack Holding BV raised $20 million from Tiger Global Management to expand its manufacturing and scale its liquid immersion cooling technology for data centers. Today's obituaries. Jeffrey Hinsliff, an English actor known for roles in Coronation Street and Doctor Who, passed away at the age of 87 on September 19, 2024. He trained at RADA and had a diverse career in TV and film, also appearing in Brass and Holby City. He survived by his wife and two children. Pierre Alonso was a French football player and manager. He played for multiple clubs before coaching teams like Paris Saint-Germain. He passed away at the age of 84 and was the father of goalkeeper Jerome Alonso. Gerti Jusuf Bogdani, born in 1980 and passed away in 2024, was an Albanian politician affiliated with the Democratic Party. He was one of the youngest mayors in Tirana, served as an MP from 2009 to 2017 and was the chairman of the International Young Democrat Union. Bogdani made significant contributions to local governance and international relations, he died from cardiac arrest at the age of 44. One Brujo is a key member of Brujeria, an American extreme metal band formed in 1989 in Los Angeles. The band is known for its Spanish lyrics on controversial topics and Mexican imagery. Brujeria features various members from the Hispanic and Latino community and maintains anonymity while projecting a drug lord persona. Other key members include Dino Cazares and Raymond Herrera. Paul Imiela, a French footballer born in 1943, played as a defender for Amiens SC. He was voted Player of the Century by Le Courrier Picard. Imiela captained both Amiens and the France national amateur team. He passed away on September 18, 2024, at the age of 81. Zulia Kamalova, born in 1969, was a Russian-born Australian singer celebrated for her interpretations of Tatar and Russian music. She moved to Australia in 1991 and formed the band Children of the Underground. Kamalova passed away in 2024 at the age of 55 after battling cancer. She was an honoured artist of the Republic of Tatarstan. 
Sam Malcolmson, born in 1947 and passing in 2024, was a New Zealand footballer. He played for Queen of the South, Albion Rovers and the national team, scoring over 50 goals in the New Zealand National League. Malcolmson represented New Zealand at the 1982 FIFA World Cup. After retiring, he co-founded Friends of Football. Salvatore Toto Schillacci, an Italian footballer known for his standout performance in the 1990 FIFA World Cup, passed away at age 59 due to colon cancer. He played for clubs including Juventus and Inter Milan and won several individual awards such as the 1990 World Cup Golden Boot and Golden Ball. Sehat Sutarja, an Indonesian billionaire and co-founder of Marvel Technology Group, was a notable figure in the tech industry with over 440 patents. He promoted green energy efficiency, supported education initiatives and founded Marvel and Silicon Box. Sutarja passed away on September 18th, 2024, at the age of 61. Malcolm Mitchell Thompson, the third Baron Selsden, aged 86, a British peer, banker and businessman and a member of the House of Lords from 1963 to 2021, has passed away. His death was announced today. Lech Saluba, age 76, Polish actor known for Girek Balada Ojanusku. All other people who have died today or yesterday, may they rest peacefully and may God have mercy on their souls. Health News. Love is Blind, season seven, cast photos and trailer. Meet the singles looking for love in Washington, D.C. Netflix's Love is Blind Season 7 trailer reveals 29 singles from Washington, D.C., including the first set of sisters, seeking love sight unseen. The 12-episode season starts October 2nd, featuring deep connections, proposals, and dramatic twists. Young writer in Green Valley releases first book after successful lemonade stand. Nora Jacoby, a fifth grader, self-published her first book titled the Four Princesses, funded by a lemonade stand. The story emphasizes helping others and coincides with her uncle's book release. A book party and public reading are planned. Entertainment News. Dimensional Fund Advisors LP acquires 62,331 shares of Nexstar Media Group Incorporated, ticker symbol NASDAQ NXST. Dimensional Fund Advisors LP increased its stake in Nexstar Media Group by 4.9% in the second quarter, now holding shares worth $220.2 million. Other institutional investors also adjusted their holdings with significant transactions and stock performance details outlined. A gorgeous red wedding gown made a splash at this Los Angeles wedding. Sharon and Bryce celebrated their Los Angeles wedding at the Natural History Museum with a travel-inspired theme. They featured bespoke rings, a red Vera Wang gown, and a navy blue custom suit. The event highlighted intentional, ethical choices and elegant, personalized details. And now a couple of dad jokes for you. Sometimes I tuck my knees into my chest and lean forward. That's just how I roll. How did the hipster burn the roof of his mouth? He ate the pizza before it was cool. Thank you for watching this AGNDD and Tele Report, dear viewers. Like, subscribe, and click the bell button to get notified during new uploads. And make sure to tune in next time. Stay safe and healthy. Cheers. Mm -hmm.